Well, it's my first day in Amen, Jordan. And uh, Jordan's a, a beautiful country with wonderful people. Uh, I put a couple photographs on my Facebook page about how when my uh, limo driver, well, it wasn't really a limo, but uh, anyway, he came picking up at the airport. And, and as we're coming back, he said, do you want some coffee? And I thought we were going to like a Starbucks. And I said, of course. And so we pulled over and there was a little stand next to a mosque. And uh, this little boy ran out and um, my driver said something to him in Arabic. And he dashed off, went into this little stand and came back with two cups of coffee. And uh, it was funny because either his father or his grandfather was back in the... Um, in the little stand, I guess, making the coffee, giving it to him, and he'd run out, give it to people who had stopped at the side of the road to get coffee, and we were on our way. Ugh, there was so much caffeine in that coffee. I could have pushed the car to the Ahasam. Man, it was like rocket fuel. Ugh, when I got down to the bottom of the glass, it was, uh, uh, it was just, I don't even know what it was. It was really thick, almost like coffee grounds. And <laughs> it was really funny. I, I've had Turkish coffee before in Turkey, but uh, this is different, stronger too, and dark. Whew, man, oh man, that stuff is a kick. But uh, so far, uh, I'm having a great time uh, enjoying the people and the, the places I've been to. I've met a guy who's actually um, from, he's from Brussels, but he is of Arabic descent. We went out last night, and I guess we're going out tonight too, because in a lot of Arabic countries, their Thursday is like our Friday, because Fridays is a holy day for them. So I guess tonight it's uh, off to some clubs. So he said, "Man, I hope it's not too late." <laughs>